All right, so I brought the Burton Cruise with me. I brought the 155. So I didn't get a chance to tune the edges. They were super rusted. The board's pretty mint, but the edges are pretty rough. It's an 89, so I would expect it to be like that. But check it out. It's a beautiful board. I was surprised how nice it was. It's in pretty nice condition. Here's the base on it. As you can see, the edges are pretty rough. The first day, I'm not gonna ride it, but uh, I'm gonna take it to gravity just to have them tune the edges. Should be cool, look at this. Hey, I was wondering if, if you guys could do the edges in a wax. No hurry, man, you okay. can take your time. I'm gonna, I have another board that I'm riding. Oh, sweet, I yeah. Just, yeah. I wanna ride this one tomorrow. You know? Okay, yeah, we'll definitely have it done. By the end of the day, if you don't need it, that's a sweet work. Yeah, thanks, man. Is that kind of old? Yeah, it's mint, man. It's a uh, '89, you know. Damn. Yeah. Um, that's awesome. Yeah, I just want to try that board just to see what it was like, you yeah, know. Yeah. Sweet. Okay, I'll go cool. see that for you. The guy was really cool. He was going to get it done in 30 minutes. I told him just to take his time. I'll pick it up to, uh, at the end of the day today because I'm going to ride it tomorrow anyways. But man, it was really cool. When I was walking around with the board, so many people were coming out to me and they were like, man, that's a cool board. And some of the guys, there were some older guys too, they recognized the board. So they were pretty hyped on it. So really, really cool just to see people uh, just happy to see a board like that. But yeah, we'll try it out tomorrow. We'll see how it feels. But today I'm just gonna enjoy the day. I got the hometown hero with me. So I'm just gonna cruise around with that. It's super, super cold today. Man, when I got here, it was like negative one, but at least the sun is coming out. So it looks much better now. Tired. Oh, tired, bro. <laughs> yeah, no. Hey, you know, I didn't so recognize slow. you at first. I started yeah. down here. I was like, I know that guy. Yeah, yeah, what yeah, dude. Dog? I, I, dude, it's freezing, huh? Yeah, it's wild out here. <laughs> Congratulations, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, dude. Thanks a lot. Yeah. Yeah.
that's the first time on this board it rips dude it's so much fun i thought this thing was gonna be really really hard to ride it goes on an edge it rips i love it let's keep riding Oh, sick. You got <laughs> I was thinking about you when I was setting up the board. I'm like, man, I want to show him, man. I'm glad I got to That's see dope. you. <laughs> yeah. That's dope. You're inspiring me. I might have to go get this. So let me tell you my experience riding this board. Uh, man, I thought this board was going to be like a heavy board that wouldn't turn, but I was completely wrong. So this board, I think paired together with the step-ons was nice and responsive. It would carve so good. The problem with the board is that if you look at it, the width of the stance, it's very narrow. So I thought that would give me some problems. It felt a little weird at first, but man, first run, I felt really good on the board. So I'm really happy that I brought the board out to Colorado to ride, but now let's take it to its new home. Let's go. Mm -hmm. 